we have this variation of life-saving, life-changing, life readjusting um, that really adds value over the therapies that are there and getting those like getting those unmet needs into uh, an assessment is actually quite difficult getting them beyond the assessment into an outcomes based contract yeah. to really be evolved is, is very very difficult and i think that's probably where the collaboration between the HGA, the regulators, um, the patients and the, and the clinicians are where we make the best efforts in including um, the patient benefits yeah. and the needs. Primarily it's about patients and making sure that the patients have the option to treat and provide additional tools. But also as we look at it, it's also about the innovation ecosystem in Europe while we're talking about it, that it's so important to achieve access. Now for finding the indicator based to what we were used is extremely difficult for a payer to understand whether this could be a good target, therapeutic target. So that's the reason I think it's completely changed on how we have to evaluate the quality of life. We come to um, an era for um, well, outcome-based agreements that rely heavily on real-world evidence being captured. So, so I think there uh, you see that the payment model needs to be in alignment with the real-world evidence. How do we increase patient literacy on incredibly complex technologies when the experts in the room are still trying to get a grasp of the, the science? You know, it's like the EQ before we had the Euro. Huh? So, mm. uh, and as long as we don't have, let's say, unified or, or healthcare systems that are very likely or representing each other, then we will probably have each country willing to do it on its, on its own, I would say. And in order to understand the added value of this novel therapy, we need to make several other type of evaluation. And this needs organization and has a cost. And no one is thinking about what is the cost of this piece. Any model we're thinking about with the different countries, and the countries are different, mm -hmm. I honestly believe that uh, there's a savings potential for the country in each and every model that we're proposing to them. Mm -hmm. How that's divvied out and how that's yeah. shared, that's probably a bigger question or another question on top of it that, uh, that does need to be clarified. Mm -hmm.